Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today, the 24th of January, Holy Mother the Church calls us to the memory of Saint Francis de Sales. Saint Francis de Sales was born in the affluent family of Francis Boise. He was born just during the revolution, the Protestant revolution. And he was one of the one of the fighters of faith, defenders of faith. He was a bishop who for 50 years of his life defended Catholic faith against the staunch Calvinism that was prevalent in his region in Geneva. At 25, he obtained the doctorate in law at Padua, but declining a senatorship, he gave up law and became a priest. His cousin and he, both of them, they volunteered to win the Calvinist inhabitants back to faith. He set up the church's principles in famous controversies, hand-copied leaflets, which he would go and give door to door. People who heard him preach were converted as much by his gracious attitude as by the lucid arguments. Francis succeeded in converting over 70,000 Calvinists and cherishing the joy of seeing all churches reopened to Catholic worship. His ministrations, though, were not without risk. At 32, Francis had signally Singly, signally so impressed Pope Clement VIII, who personally examined in the presence of his cardinals that he was appointed to become the Bishop of Geneva. As Bishop, Francis drastically simplified his lifestyle so as to enable him the, to better the succor the poor and the needy. He reformed religious communities formulated simple language catechetical instruction for both young and the old and held annual synods for his clergy. Voluminous correspondence apart, he made time to write guidance called the Introduction to Devout Life. He was known so much for his catechetical teachings that he wrote the treatise on the love of God and spiritual conferences, both addressed to the visitation sisters that he and Saint Jane Francis de Chantal had founded in 1610. Beatified in the year 1662 and canonized in 1665, Francis was declared doctor of the church in 1877. Saint Francis de Sales is known as the gentle and humble saint. One word that he said always rings in my mind. He said, One spoon of honey can draw more flies than what barrel full of vinegar can. A spoon of honey can draw more flies to itself than a barrel full of vinegar. So he wants us to be that scent, that perfume of Christ, that fragrance of Christ to the world, that we through the sweetness of Christ may attract the world to Christ. We pray like St. Francis de Chantals, like St. Francis de Sales, we may get more and more people to God.